welcome to another episode of The Beautiful. I'm Vanessa. If you are a subscriber, thank you so much for being a part of this beauty community. And if you're new here, thank you for checking out this video and hanging out with me. This video I have been looking so forward to because we're gonna unwind together. One of my favorite things to do is relax, chill out, have some me time. I'm gonna show you kind of like my little routine. Not really like products that are, I'm like looking for results, you know what I mean? This is more about like, I just wanna take that extra time and relax and do something for myself. And if that's what you're looking to do too, you're in the right place. So let's get started. First things first, you're gonna want to like set your scene, get your candles, get your playlist. There's nothing worse than trying to decide like what music you're gonna listen to in the middle of relaxing. So like do that ahead of time and now we are all set to go. So I like to start with the Josie Marin Sugar Body Scrub. I love using this stuff. Um, it's got a really great texture to it. Like look how just rich it is. I don't feel like I do this as often as I'd really like to. And so when I'm taking my me time, this is something that I really, really enjoy doing. Spoiler alert, we are gonna take a very luxurious bubble bath. We're gonna get all set up for that. But I'm one of those weird people that I'd like to actually be clean before I get in the bath. I like to enjoy a bath more for just like soaking. And so I feel weird if I get into the bath before I shower. So the benefit of being weird like that is I'm gonna go ahead and scrub all over. Then I'm gonna hop in the shower really quickly to rinse off and I'm gonna use my L'Occitane shower oil to get nice and clean. This is like my favorite showering product. I love the texture, I love the smell. I mean, it really is like, French luxury at its finest. Um, so I'm gonna rinse off, and then we're gonna do a teeny tiny bit of skincare, nothing really laborious because we're relaxing, right? And then we're gonna get into our bath. Let me keep scrubbing. Okay, you guys, my skin feels so bomb. I mean, that Josie Marin and that L'Occitane, it really like sets the stage for the relaxation that's to follow. So now we're going to get our bath started while we take care of our skin just a little bit. So I'm using Philosophy's 3-in-1 Shampoo Shower Gel Bubble Bath because it really is like the best bubble bath. And I'm using the scent Sweet Vanilla Fig. Can you tell how much I love this scent? I mean, when you're going with Philosophy, you can't really go wrong with any scent, but I just feel like Sweet Vanilla Fig is like, for me, that spa-like calming scent. So when I'm doing like the self-care moment, the relaxation time, I absolutely love to go with this scent. So we're gonna get started in the tub. Look at these amazing bubbles. Already starting, I can't wait to get in here. We are gonna do a little skincare first before we see our bubble beauty. So for skincare, I like to keep it simple when it's like my self-care time because I don't want to spend a lot of like stressful 8,000 steps when I'm supposed to be relaxing. So we're going to start with Purity from Philosophy. It is your one-step cleanser. Like that's all you need. You just do a little Purity and you're good to go. I think some of it kind of spilled out my pump a little bit. Um, but Purity is great because you just really do one step. So it is your makeup remover, it's your cleanser, and it just feels great on my skin too. It's gentle. Okay, so one step and done with Purity. And now our second step is gonna be our Pure, Pure, our Pore Extractor Mask, which is also part of the Purity family from Philosophy. And what I love about this mask is that it's easy to put on, you leave it on for like five or 10 minutes, really just you're leaving it on until it's dry, and then you just rinse it off and it comes off really easy. It is the clay mask and it's not one of those masks that like crumbles up on me a lot, which I hate. Um, so this is definitely my go-to for like, you know, when I want a little skincare, but I don't wanna go too crazy. And Philosophy's there for me. And you just kind of smooth this all over and then let it dry. The whole bathroom smells incredible right now. Like I cannot wait to get into that tub. All right, so we're gonna leave this on and let it dry. 
Oh my gosh, look at that. Like, see, I told y'all philosophy is not playing when it comes to the bubbles. Okay, so the cool thing about this mask is that you can kind of test to see, like, if it's done cooking. And so I just like to touch my face and I don't have anything on my hand, so that means that it is dry. Oh, no, that part is still not dry. So I've got a couple more minutes maybe left to go. All right, I think we're good to go. So see how it's like scrubby a little bit? I don't know if you can see, I hope that you can. Um, Cause that's the cool thing that I love about this mask. But if you can't see it, just know that you get a little bit of a scrubby, not too much, it's not like intense or like aggressive, but just enough. Okay, now <laughs> it's bath time. Basically by the time you're done washing your face and doing your mask, it's pretty much time to get in the tub. I'm gonna give you one last look in the bubbles, but you can't, you cannot come in here with me. You can't, this is a family YouTube channel. We're not doing all that. Well, the bubbles are going down the drain and I'm sad to see them go, but they did their job. What's left is for us to finish up our routine with a little Josie Marin. I've got the Milk Intense Hydrating Body Renewal Serum from, jo from Josie Marin. And this is another step that I don't usually do when I'm kind of just like, you know, showering, getting out the door, just trying to get together really quickly. But this is a step that you put on before the body butter it's just that extra little luxury for me when i'm doing like my self-care time it's a little thin layer so this is all i'm going to use for one of my legs and then just go ahead and massage it in and it just like really glides over your skin it feels great going on it is the perfect like bow on a philosophy bath because i feel like after a philosophy bath i don't feel so like oh i need to put lotion right away um, so this is just like really the icing on the cake. Look how nicely that goes in. For my body butter, I'm going with Unscented. This is Josie's Whipped Argan Oil Body Butter. Such a beautiful texture with this stuff. Oh, it's just so good. I wanted to go with Unscented because I'm still enjoying, like I have a candle lit and then that mixed with the sweet vanilla fig from the philosophy is really like my sensory experience happening right now. And so I wanted to go on scented so I can continue taking in those scents, but also still enjoy the goodness that is Josie's body butter. You start with the milk, right? That's like the bow on the top of the philosophy bath. And then I don't even know what's higher than the bow. But whatever that is, that would be what the body butter is. I love it. So that's what I wanted to go with today in Unscented. So we're gonna finish things off with a touch of Tatcha. This is the Tatcha Dewy Skin Cream. And that's what I'm gonna use as my final step in our little kind of basic skincare routine. Like basic, but not basic. Like I feel like Philosophy's Purity Line minimizes your steps, but it's still not basic because it does the job, but you just don't have to do all the steps. And of course with Tatcha, I love these little golden spatulas that come. Tatcha's packaging is just so beautiful. And this is just a really lovely cream um, to, you know, act as our finishing touch for the night. So I'm just gonna go ahead and take a little bit and just massage this into my skin. I love that it has like a little bit of a richer texture. Um, it feels really good going on. And we're gonna finish with the Tatcha Kishu Lip Mask. And this is overnight, like you just leave this on, you don't have to take it off, which is what I love. Cause sometimes it's a pain trying to like, you know, remember to take off a lip mask or like doing the scrub. So I like that you just leave this one on. Can you see like those little flecks in there? This is gorgeous. Like I almost don't wanna use it cause it's so pretty. So I'm just gonna take a little bit with our spatula and apply this to my lips. My lips have been so dry lately, so this little self-care day is right on time. I like to go a little outside too, just to make sure I'm getting my whole lip.
And that's it. That does it for our Unwind With Me Together video. I hope you enjoyed this routine. Let me know what your unwinding routine is like. I'd love to hear about it. What products you like, what steps you do. Let's chat about it in the comment section. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe. There will be new videos in the V Beautiful series coming your way. And I will see you next time. Bye.